I want to thank you, Reverend Jackson, for coming on such short notice. Hilary, I am a servant of the people. I am happy to do whatever it is I can do. We're really at our wit's end here, Jess. I mean... <laughs> Mr. President, why, why are you wearing eyelashes? Because he's my bitch. <laughs> I'm a bitch. That's right. Hello, Aaron. <laughs> Billy here has made some terrible, terrible mistakes. Mistakes for which there are no excuse. But you must remember, when David sinned with Bathsheba, he repented, and he too was forgiven. Well, there you have it, case closed. Hey! <laughs> Reverend, once David repented, he kept it zipped up, right? She's got you there, Billy. <laughs> Bill, dear, would you mind hitting yourself on the head with the coffee table while I have a word with the reverend? You got it, Hill. <laughs> now, Hillary, I know that right now you are feeling a furious and righteous vengeance, but you must remember, I know that even though you feel betrayed and bewildered and beside yourself, things will get better. <laughs> I'm afraid you're missing the point, reverend. Chelsea! Yeah, Mom? Why don't you show the Reverend Daddy's sardine act? Daddy's a butler. Hey, Chelsea! Yeah! Stop that! <laughs> Chelsea! <laughs> I insist that this behavior desists for the good of the country. <laughs> Reverend Jesse, maybe you should hear about phase two of my payback plan. Jesse, do you remember about six months ago you did a speech at the Hyatt Regency? We shared a crowded elevator, and you were wedged in tight behind me. That was involuntary reaction. I was thinking about God. I liked it. And I would like for you to come on up to my room and do some more thinking about God. Well, I suppose I could come up to your room for a couple of hours and... Uh, you know what? This has gone on hey! far enough. Why? It will have gone on far enough when I say it's gone on far enough, and I'm not going to say it's gone on far enough till it has gone all the way. Is that clear? <laughs> Not least watching. <laughs>